Hello everyone, Andy here, hope you are well. I um, hope you've had a good week so far and um, hopefully this video will help you out as well. You've obviously searched for the problem that you are running low on space in Final Cut Pro. Um, you know, you've got a lot of projects on the go, you don't want to delete them, your hard drive is going lower and lower and lower um, and you just don't know what to do. So um, I've got some good news for you, uh, keep, keep tuned in, keep watching this video, it won't take too long and I'm going to show you how to get those gigabytes back and to increase the amount, or I should say, reduce the amount of um, space it's using up on your hard drive. So without further ado, let's get on with it. Okay, so what you need to do is to go to your desktop, um, go to your uh, HD drive. Um, on the hard drive, you want to click on Users, and Users, find yourself, find your user. Then you want to go to this one, which is the Movies file. Go to the Final Cut Pro editable. Now what you do is just click and right click on this. And now what you want to do is you want to click on the show package contents. Then when you're in here, this is actually going to be basically the various um, videos that you're making, which is the folders of the videos that you're making in Final Cut Pro. And what we should do is make a little mental note of the actual gigabytes that you've currently got and then you'll see the difference when we've done this. So what you want to do is on the actual files which are your videos, like this one, um, you need to come across and the render files, what you want to do is just right click, move to trash. I'll just keep going through all these, I'm not going to mention what each one is, but I am going along and just moving to trash all the render files. I'm just going to speed this process up. Okay, and that is it. That was the final folder where I've deleted the render files. So you can close this folder now. Um, just before we do, let's just have a quick look uh, just to see the difference. Bearing in mind, this is not a lot uh, of content that I have deleted. I've done much, much more than this before in the past. But we've got 335, 336 nearly gig available. Now all we need to do is go to the trash, right click, and empty it and let's see the difference between the 335.7 gig and when we empty this. You can see, look at the top right here, the amount of items that are being deleted. It is insane. The amount of files that are actually there in the background that you really don't need if you're not going to be editing those videos. What was it? 335, nearly 336 gig. And now I've got 512, is it going to have any more? 517 gig now available. Look at that difference from 335, 336 gig to 517. I've nearly got, what was that, only about 180 gig of available disk space now just from deleting the trash, deleting those rendering files. It is incredible sometimes. Um, the difference is that if I was to go to one of these um, projects, then it would have to re-render the actual sort of um, event. But if you're not working on it, then it's absolutely fine. Okay, everyone, so I really hope that was of some help for you. And um, it was really simple, as I mentioned. It really is a quick fix. Um, and if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe and uh, click the little bell icon to keep up to date with future videos. Um, and in regards to that, something that I'm going to be looking to do on my channel fairly soon is when I do my next drone video um, with the DJI Mavic 2, um, I'm going to look at doing a step-by-step -step on um, how I edit my video so it's as if it's like a live feed into how I do it, minute by minute. I'm not going to cut out any rubbish that I do. If I make mistakes, you're going to see I make mistakes. If I take a while to uh, get something right, you're going to see why and how that takes that long to get that right. Hopefully it'll give you some ideas in your own video editing. I'm showing you drone because that's what I'm passionate about, but these aspects of the way I edit could help you um, or take inspiration from them anyway um, in any of the videos that you are making. So as I mentioned, feel free to subscribe and for those videos, make sure you're the first to see them by clicking that little bell icon Thanks everyone again for watching and see you again soon. Bye.